Uh, hello, Claudia. How are you? How was your day today? Hello, Xenia. Um, I am just uh, woke up about two hours ago, <laughs> so it's okay. Me, me too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so um, now you can tell us about yourself, about your life, maybe about your hobbies, maybe about your expectation to your partner, so it's your moment. And after you finish your story, I will mm -hmm. ask you a couple of questions. Okay. Uh, so, hello everybody. My name is Claudia. Uh, I live in St. Petersburg for already 10 years. Uh, I moved uh, to here from uh, my uh, hometown, Krasnodar. Uh, so, uh, I have already finished uh, my university. So, I have uh, uh, education. <laughs> uh, I live uh, here with uh, two cats. I have two Siamese cats. I live uh, with them uh, alone. Uh, now, uh, um, what about my hobbies? For example, I like I like uh, driving my car. I adore cats. I love to listen to music. Uh, I love to visit uh, art exhibitions here in the city and some museums also. Uh, I love the city. Uh, for me now, it's better cold weather than hot weather, but now we have hot weather, unfortunately. <laughs> Too hot here in St. Petersburg is now. Um, what else? Um, <laughs> uh, I'm uh, tall. Uh, 175 centimeters. Uh, so I <laughs> accept uh, maybe a tall man, uh, maybe taller than me, for example. Uh, as I'm smart, I also love smart people. <laughs> That's why uh, I need a smart person uh, near me. Um, I don't know, a little bit taller than me. Mm. Uh, uh, me, I'm a, an attentive person, for example, so I love attentive people uh, the same as me. Um, what else? Um, I have some close friends, they are almost the same as me, so I uh, prefer to uh, find a man um, who will be familiar to me, maybe, at some moments. It will be uh, more comfortable for mm -hmm. me. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, do you like traveling? I think you do, but you know you didn't, <laughs> you didn't mention it. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I like I love traveling, but now we have that situation. That yeah, yeah. Situation. Even, yeah, we can't even uh, go somewhere only through Turkey. <laughs> but anyway, uh, in past times, yeah, I traveled a lot. Uh, uh, with my ex work, also I traveled a lot to Paris and uh, France, Paris, and uh, to Berlin in Germany. Uh, the most I adore Germany. I love the style. I love the people and everything in uh, Germany in Berlin. Uh, I also been uh, to Hamburg uh, and some other cities. Ah, Roost. Rus city is a small town. It's a small town, not city. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so uh, I like Germany. I've been in uh, Ibiza, in London, in uh, Zurich. Uh, what else? In Finland, somewhere near Helsinki. Um, ah, in Italy, in Milan also. Quite, and... quite, quite a lot. Where is your favorite place? You said you like uh, you like Germany, but from all the countries you've visited, uh, where is your favorite place? Uh, Berlin in Germany. Berlin. Berlin. Okay, I liked Hamburg more, but you know, yeah, Berlin is nice. <laughs> yeah, Hamburg is also very nice. Yeah, it's beautiful. Uh, ha Hamburg is very similar to Saint Petersburg. It's really the same weather, the same weather. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, a lot of uh, strong winds and water. <laughs> like, like, it, like at home. Yeah. <laughs> home sweet home. Uh, okay, so uh, you live alone with your cats. You have some close friends. Uh, do you like partying or meeting friends or cooking for friends? Something like this meet up with people you like and uh, some yeah, social... Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I love to meet with my friends. Sometimes we cook together some dishes. <laughs> Uh, we, te- we teach each other to cook some different dishes uh, because I have friends from different regions of Russia. Some of my friends are from Moscow, some of them from uh, Bash- Bashkiria. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, uh, and so on. Ah, I-, I have a, my closest friend. She's from uh, Nakhotka city. It's uh, near Vladivostok. <laughs> yeah. Oh, somewhere on the other side of the map. Oh, yes, somewhere on the other side of Russia where I have never been yet. <laughs> uh, so it's interesting uh, to cook with them, to uh, to talk with them. Of course, uh, almost all of my friends are younger than me. I'm the oldest. I'm like mother chicken. <laughs> yeah. You just come here. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> like mom. Okay. Okay, but you trained with your cats to be a mother, so, so it's yeah. a couple of younger friends are the same like cat. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I club you look uh, very sporty, you look very fit. Uh, do you do any exercises or any sport activities? Uh, about sport activities, activities, I like cycling. I have uh, my own bike. So at summer, I love cycling. I took my bike to some places. We have some parks, big parks, huge parks in St. Petersburg, where you can just uh, put your bike and uh, have a ride there with your friend or alone. It's okay. But now, it, 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 um, pref, 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 uh better to cycle uh in the evening or at night because uh it's uh, daylight is so hot <laughs> yeah can imagine yeah Even for right. walking. <laughs> yeah but but a lion don't move yeah uh okay so um you told us about your character and a little bit about uh, that you would like to meet a partner taller than you. Uh, what, uh, but what uh, are the expectations to the character of your partner? What kind of man would you like to meet? Mm, first of all, smart and uh, adequate, you know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, it's uh, the most important for me. Um uh, not n- nice face uh taller than me i prefer dark hair and light eyes or blue eyes uh the most adorable for me mm-hmm. yeah mm, i don't know what else <laughs> okay then and then i ask the question in different way um are there any things you don't like so some no goes in relationships some things you learn from your experience and you would never repeat in your relationship again uh maybe some psychopath parts <laughs> yeah. i don't like of course yeah like, like every woman uh, some, some women like it they always choose the psychopath and then complain yeah yeah uh yeah mm-hmm. i don't know maybe it's uh smoking or you know too much drinking or i don't know you you, you oh don't yeah 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 too much drinking is, is not good for me of course uh, smoking it's 50 uh, 50 maybe it's okay but it depends of uh, how much person uh, uh, for how much person is smoking uh i i like kind people kind to animals and so on uh because i have two cats <laughs> and i need it's, to it's, it's, it's my next question because uh, i heard i don't know how true is it that there are cat people and there mm-hmm. are dog people. Uh-huh. How, how will you react if, for example, you meet a guy, a nice guy, you know, dark hair, light eyes, you know, you the man of your dream with five mm-hmm. dogs? <laughs> well, we need to communicate our animals. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no, your, ani- your animals should discuss, should negotiate what to do. <laughs> They should discuss who will be the main uh, animal in the, in the apartment. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. It's okay for me. I also love dogs. I uh, just prefer cats more. That's why, yeah. But dogs are also good. It's interesting to live with dogs. I never live with dogs. <laughs> yeah, so it will be an interesting opportunity. <laughs> uh, my friend, she has uh, three dogs and one cat. And just because being uh, bringing up with dogs, this cat thinks it is a dog. 
and the best dog in the family. So this cat is more dog than dog. It's really interesting. Uh, so this cat uh, rules the family, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so. Uh, okay, so uh, my uh, probably last question. Um, mm -hmm. What is your idea about your family? So just imagine you meet the perfect man and you uh, you have your perfect life. How this perfect life uh, should look like? So mm -hmm. What is your dream about your future? Mm -hmm. uh, I think I want to move to another country, maybe to Europe or maybe to America. I, I've never been in America and I think it's... Uh, Maybe, I, I only think about it, maybe it's a perfect country for me, but uh, I've been a lot of times in Europe, so maybe I... Marcia, Idi, <laughs> sorry, <laughs> my case. Uh, maybe I will move to Germany, for example. Uh, so I will have a husband. I was also thinking about two children. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a husband and two children, <laughs> a okay. boy and a girl. <laughs> It's like low risk. <laughs> yeah. Uh, and uh, how this family should like, you know, so what is your, I don't know, what you, it's your feeling about your future family? Ah, uh, maybe the concept. You mean like yeah. the concept of the family? Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, I think uh, we both should work, but the men should work a uh, little more, <laughs> for mm -hmm. example. Yeah, and uh, of course, uh, in the future, when uh, I will have pregnancy and babies, I need uh, more help from from the side, for example, with the babies and so on. Yeah, mm -hmm. but I, uh, I'm i not kind of a person who wants to sit at home with children all the time, so I want to work also. Mm -hmm. So it will be the, the maybe the best concept for me at the moment, yeah. Okay, cool, great. So it was really great, amazing. You know, unfortunately, we couldn't see your cat. <laughs> it was it was nearby. Uh, thank you so much. Thank you so much. You know, have fun with your kiddies, <laughs> with your kiddies at home. Thank you. And, yeah, thank you so much. And boys, if you watch this interview, if you want to, to meet Claudia, please contact me and I will give you the, uh, the contact information and you can discuss everything about uh, cats and dogs. Yes. <laughs> Спасибо большое. Спасибо большое. До свидания. Спасибо. До свидания.